All right. Project Prelude. This is the Prelude Project Supercharge. Uh, this video, I'm going to do the fuel pump uh, wiring relay upgrade. Um, I'll, I'll get you inside here. So, with this setup, doing uh, boosted prelude and stuff, uh, boosted vehicle, especially Hondas, you need to upgrade your uh, fuel system, especially the fuel pump. I got the 250 Walbro, I believe, on this. That's what they said, but I'm not sure if it's true. I had to open it up, see what's in there. And while I'm here, um, upgrade the wiring and uh, the relay, put inline fuse. It, this is a really good, uh, I guess, uh, having a battery at the back. It's really uh, just need the short power from the battery going to the direct to the fuel pump. You get the solid you know 12.5 volts power to the fuel that that fuel is gonna have a lot amperage and power to uh, feed the, the engine so um, while doing this uh, my fuel level is uh, kind of wonky uh, I think um, having like a full tank and it just gives me like a three-quarter of a tank so I'm gonna do diagnose on that so on this case, uh, this video, I'm gonna do the um, fuel pump uh, wiring relay upgrade. So, um, uh, this I'm on that the spot where they're taking the feed and, and return. I believe this is return. This is feed. And after that, taking out all those, what, seven bolts? Six, six, six bolts. Six bolts. All right. So, um, that's it. Okay. I have to disconnect, disconnect the line. Um, make sure there's no pressure on the line. If if the vehicle been haven't been started for, like, you know, um couple hours it would have no pressure now or less pressure but this vehicle i've mean, been ran for like six months so i just disconnect the two uh two lines feed and return and there's not much fuel coming out um so that's good make, make sure you release the pressure when uh, disconnecting the the feed line and now taking out all these bolts these bolts this uh, i don't know if i mentioned in the video this is the fuel pump module and this is the level sending unit right here okay we're about to take out the uh, the fuel pump housing now um all the bolts are gone taken out and uh let's see what this thing looked like for the first time Oh wow, the strainer is gone. Uh, somebody modified it here. They cut the, somehow they cut the bracket that holds the pump. Um, this is interesting. I don't know what pump this is. We'll find out, I guess. We'll do some research. So make, make sure to have some rag laid down here. Uh, I got mine, make, make sure it's not it's not gonna leak to your seats. Got the rag in there. I think the strainer. If the strainer is uh, gone, probably is inside here. Um, I can't see anything. But anyway, so I'm gonna have to look in there with the flashlight. Uh, but this is the pump, guys. Um, 
I bought this vehicle with uh, this unfinished project and I bought it from a guy so I don't know what he done um, we'll find out what kind of pump that is okay so um, this is the first step of uh, doing the upgrade on the fuel pump wiring harness and relay um, we're gonna modify some of this stuff and uh, yeah, uh, stay tuned for the next video.